Back. Wild horses have a sizable presence here on the western slope, and according to the Bureau of Land Management, there are too many of the animals in this area. But the agency's planned method for conducting an upcoming roundup is sparking some controversy. Our Timber Schumann has the details. Nestled in the book cliffs of western Colorado, wild horses roam freely without predators. In 2002, an appropriate management level for the Book Cliff Wild Horses was set at 90 to 150. We currently have about 220 horses that are on the range. BLM Colorado Public Affairs Specialist Heather Marsh tells me BLM will use a helicopter to round up roughly 100 horses. It actually um, is quicker and it can provide less stress on the horses. The helicopter will herd the horses toward a corral where some will be sent away to a holding facility in Canyon City. Some of the horses that are gathered will receive fertility control treatments. We have the world's largest fertility control program situated in Nevada. Colorado spokesman for the American Wild Horse Conservation Scott Wilson says the use of helicopters is both inhumane and excessively costly for the American taxpayer. Rounding out a helicopter and then holding them for life cost the taxpayer $48,000. That's per horse. He says implementing birth control once a year through a dart only costs roughly $500 per animal. And if the horse lives to be 20 years old, that's $10,000 for the rest of its lifetime. So it's categorically not sterilization. It's a reversible um, uh, humane program. The safety of the horses, the staff, and everybody around is our, our primary concern. Everyone involved um, in the gather um, has to be trained on what we have. It's called the um, uh, Comprehensive Animal Welfare uh, Program. This includes the pilot, which Marsh says will stay as far back as half a mile at times when hurting the horses. The date of the roundup is still in question, though officials are shooting for mid-September to comply with the letter Governor Polis sent BLM stating a list of concerns for the roundup, one of which being excessive heat if done in the summertime. The BLM will also have a state veterinarian present during the roundup in response to Polis's concern. The governor also had worries about the use of helicopters, but BLM officials say the scale of this operation is just too big to use a different method, like a bait trap operation. It just feels like an intransigent act by the BLM. We are committed to managing for healthy horses on healthy lands. Again, some of the horses during this book cliff roundup will be administered birth control. Wilson just hopes birth control will be the main way of maintaining the population in the near future. Timber Schumann, Care Reacts.